Presented by Listen Headlines. Latest financial news from trusted sources. January 28, 1900 America New York. How is Omicron affecting the global economic recovery? High-frequency data suggest the effect may be limited and short-lived. January 28, 1900 America New York. Quantitative tightening is no substitute for higher interest rates. Reversing trillions of dollars of asset purchases may prove to be an unreliable tool. January 28, 1900 America New York, personal finance is a hit on TikTok. One survey suggests nearly a quarter of young American investors have used it for financial advice. January 28, 1900 America New York, Australian dollar outlook. All eyes on the RBA as Fed fallout continues. The Australian dollar is under the pump despite favorable fundamentals as the US dollar surges on the back of a hawkish Fed. January 28, 1900 America New York, has Deutsche Bank turned the corner? Investors seem to think the bank has stabilized at last. January 28, 1836 America New York, Mike Lynch, Pretty Patel approves extradition of autonomy founder. Dr. Mike Lynch lost a multi-billion dollar fraud action on Friday over the sale of autonomy in 2011. January 28, 1810 America New York, Shopify denies allegations in textbook pirating lawsuit. The e-commerce company said it isn't liable for copyright infringement by sellers and has responded to takedown requests. January 28, 1742 America New York, Two Army veterans awarded $110 million in 3M earplug lawsuit. Nearly 300,000 people are involved in lawsuits accusing 3M of having sold the military defective combat earplugs that left service members with tinnitus and hearing loss. 3M, which has its global headquarters in Maplewood, Min, has defended the earplugs as effective and safe to use. January 28. 1712 America New York, Goldman doubles David Solomon's pay to $35 million. Wall Street firm posted record annual profit in 2021. January 28, 1703 America New York, Storm Arwen. I was left without broadband for seven weeks. A holiday firm owner says he lost bookings because of the time it took to restore an internet link. January 28. 1702 America New York, where are Britain's missing million workers? With vacancies at a record high, many firms are suffering from a shortage of skilled workers. January 28, 1700 America New York, a market crash will depend on which bit of the equation investors got wrong. Proper bubbles involve people convincing themselves that a high profit, low inflation environment will be permanent. January 28, 1433 America New York, Chevron still has gas in its tank. Chevron's record-breaking results weren't enough to keep up with its record-breaking share prices. With the strongest balance sheet among peers, though, it will have more flexibility to woo investors later in the year. January 28, 1413 America New York, Robinhood shares swing in volatile session after earnings miss. The brokerage's stock fell as much as 14% at the start of the session before turning positive, one day after it reported a loss of $423 million for the fourth quarter. January 28, 1412 America New York, port congestion spreads across more U.S. import gateways. Backups have been rising at Charleston, South Carolina, and Oakland, California, as ports wrestle with continuing cargo surges and COVID-related worker absences. January 28, 1330 America New York, when your office decides the pandemic is over. The burden shouldn't be on you to draw boundaries, but you will have to do it. January 28, 1241 America New York, Argentina agrees deal with IMF to restructure debt from $57 billion bailout. Government averts looming crisis over billions of dollars in payments owed to fund. January 28, 1229 America New York, FAA says it has reached a deal over 5G service at airports. The federal agency said an agreement with Verizon and at an amp. T would enable the wireless providers to expand their networks while allowing aircraft to land safely. A cell tower near Los Angeles International Airport. January 28, 1211 America New York, Friday Assorted Links. 1. 
UT Austin Workshop in March on Progress Studies, 2. The Dating Culture That Is D.C., with a partial cameo by Jordan Peterson, 3. My Bloomberg column on whether we should be worried by falling crypto prices, no. And will recent SEC proposals stifle crypto? January 28, 1154 America New York, Chamber of Commerce raises concerns over Fed nominee Raskin. The business lobbying group called on members of the Senate Banking Committee to question Sarah Bloom Raskin about her prior statements, which include calls to use financial regulation to address threats posed by climate change. January 28, 1143 America New York, China warns of risk of military conflict with U.S. over Taiwan. Ambassadors' comments are a rare example of the communist state's officials talking directly about the possibility of war. January 28, 1129 America New York, Market Talk, January 28, 2022. Asia. India's economic momentum remained stable in December even as the first signs of slowing output growth appeared across some industries. Activity in India's dominant services sector expanded for the fifth month, and manufacturing for the sixth, although growth in new work and production lost some momentum, according to IHS Market. January 28, 1127 America New York, Biden sanctions plan targets Russian banks, companies and imports if Ukraine is attacked. The Biden administration is narrowing its possible economic sanctions. The plan, which is still being finalized, would prohibit a range of activities. January 28, 1101 America New York, Bank of America Fed outlook gets more hawkish amid inflation worries. Bank of America has shifted its outlook for U.S. monetary policy in a decidedly hawkish direction, saying seven rate rises from the central bank are likely in 2022. January 28, 11 o'clock America New York, British pound forecast, GBP, USD awaits potential bow balance sheet bonanza. The pound may be in for a breather leading up to next week's bow rate decision with markets pricing in an almost certain 25 bits per second rate hike. January 28, 11 o'clock America New York, the two things to do when the stock market gets crazy. Turbulent times can cause investors to make decisions they'll later regret. Here's how to stay afloat in these choppy waters without sinking your future.